Edward's branch line is a very important part of the whole railway. It runs all the way towards the end of Brendan Docks. But recently, over the summer, more people have come to the branch line and report it's getting too much for all the engines. That's why Sir Topham had decided to reunite some of his engines to talk. It seems the work here is too much for all of you. So I've ordered an engine from Kenya. She'll be coming in towards Solo. But that won't be enough since the mainline is going through the same thing. So an engine from the mainline will come in a few days. But for now, the engine from Kenya is coming today. Here she is, Edward, this is Nia, she's come all the way from Kenya. Hello, Edward. Hello, Nia. Edward, show Nia around. She'll have her first job today. She'll pull your passenger trains while you pull your goods trains. If you say so, sir. Mia was doing perfect on her first run. The passengers liked her and she was enjoying it on the railway. But Edward, on the other hand, was worried. I am getting a little bit too old for this branch line. What is the top and half thinks of scrapping me and replacing me with her? Nonsense, Edward. You are the soldier's number two. The first engine to arrive here, besides me, Gordon Henry. You're one of the first three railway engines. He's right, you know. So Top of would never do this to our favorite engine. While Edward was happy that his friends were there to protect him, he was still worried. To determine that he was not that old, Edward was pulling a long goods train as fast as he could. He came over the top of Gordon's hill. Edward tried to pull as hard as he could, but it was hard for him to get to the top. No matter how much he tried, Edward couldn't get the train up the hill. Mia came by. First he pulled, she pulled Edward to a siding and then she took the rest of his train all the way. But Edward was still worried. He was sure Nia was going to replace him now. But then, it was Nia who needed his help. She was pulling a passenger train over Golden Hill when all of a sudden... Oh no! She said. She had run out of water. The guard went to call for help. Only Edward was there, and despite having a dislike towards Nia, he decided to just help her. It's the best I can do, he said. He came up behind Nia and, and coupled her. Come on, Nia, he said. With all his strength, Edward pushed Nia all the way to Nefra Station. After Edward shunted Nia into a siding, they both decided to talk. Edward explained to Nia about him worrying about replacing him. Don't worry, Edward. I came all the way from Kenya to help you. You are still a really useful engine in my opinion. That made Edward happy. From that day on, Edward and Nia were best friends. They both will say hi to you every time you got to the station. There's still one more doubt that I have. I wonder who the new engine is going to be. I don't know. I guess we'll have to wait and see. But that's another story.